Hi students! So today I'd like to look at one situation with you and look at one language feature that is extremely important in engineering and technical context. So I'd like to give you the first situation or the first perspective on the situation. Here we have a boy. Okay, um, the boy kicks a little ball because he loves playing football. Okay, nice situation. So let's look at this situation now from a different perspective or another angle, let's say. Um, here we have a ball and the ball is kicked by a little boy. Okay, so you would say this is exactly the same thing. So what are you telling me here? So let me explain the difference. What we have here in the first situation is the focus. You can see the light here. That is a focus on the boy. So we say the boy kicks the ball. On the other hand, what we have here in the second picture is the ball is kicked. And the boy is actually not really important. What is important for us is the ball. Okay, we call this first one here active voice. And this here, passive voice. So what does passive voice do? Passive voice actually puts the focus represented here by the light source on another part in the sentence grammatically or on another thing in the situation that we want to explain. For us, the second uh, situation here is extremely important because when we talk about technical context, a lot of focus is put on the object. What happens with the object? What happens with something that is being processed? What happens with the material? And so on and so on. So passive voice in our context is an extremely important grammatical a feature that we need to know. Let's take a quick look at how it is formed. We always have a form of B. The form of B is adjusted by the subject of the sentence. We also always have the third form of the verb. And the third form can be the regular one with ED, as it is here, or it is the third form that you learned with irregular verbs at school. Okay, we call this form past participle as well. You will train a lot of these passive voice sentences in the following parts because, as I said, they are important and they need some training because they change our focus of the world as well. Okay, let's do so.